Hi, everybody. Um, we are here live from New York City. So I'm on East Coast time. So I'm feeling everyone's pain way past my bedtime, but excited to be here. And I've got Megan with me. Lisa's going to be here in a minute. And Megan was commenting on the incredibly huge palatial suite that I'm staying in here <laughs> in the historic New Yorker Hotel. Um, but I am really excited. And what's really cool for me is that I get to talk loud because I don't have any babies sleeping upstairs. So I can be loud and enthusiastic, my normal self, and not the very mellow guy you're used to seeing on Sunday nights. But um, Megan, ha let's start with some positives. What's been good that's been happening for you in the in your Beachbody business this week? Um, I sold a Shakeology Home Direct. Very nice. That is not just one bag, but two bags per month. Sweet. So that was my big win for the week. That's awesome. Yeah. That's really great. I know, um, well, what I was going to tell you guys is just, you know, keeping a product of the product and keep doing what you guys are doing because it really does build momentum over time. And I have to say for me personally, it's hitting a point now where almost constantly I'm having a conversation about Beachbody, which is pretty cool. Yeah, I know. In a minute. So today I was traveling, you know, with a bunch of people to a Buffini event in New York, people I work with, and in the airport this morning in San Diego, I had three Beachbody conversations. On the, on the shuttle back from the airport here in New York City, had more conversations. And so it's just a matter of people taking notice and paying attention to what we're doing and, and getting excited about what's happening. And then the other thing that's kind of cool is I, I had two people buy challenge packs this week. Um, one signed my commitment form to join the T25 group two months ago. This is kind of weird. I've had a few people fill out the commitment form and commit to the group, but not place an order. So I just continually stay in touch with them because I figure they're just busy, right? And it got to a point with this particular person, I'm just sharing this with you guys because I don't know, hopefully you can benefit from the experience, where I knew she wanted to do T25 and the discount was expiring, the end of the month discount. And so I'm messaging her saying, today is, is it. She's got a crazy stuff going on. Her dad is really sick. He's got cancer. She's, he's in chemo, and so she's taking care of him. So this is, this is the most random thing. She Facebook messages me her Amex card number and information and says, can you please just place the order for me before the yep. deadline? So it's amazing that people um, – have the amount of trust that they have in us as beach body coaches. But I think it's a testament to the fact that we're really trying to help people, you know? Um, and then I had somebody else just comment on a video. This, by the way, the video, how to make your Shakeology has been, that video has been crazy for me because I posted that for our current challengers. But to date, I've already got four people who have bought because of that video. Um, just because they saw it and thought it was interesting and saw the likes and comments on it. And then just a couple people just went and ordered Shakeology. And I got pinged today from somebody I don't even know who follows me on Facebook, wanting more information about Shakeology. And I messaged back and forth with her. And um, she's probably going to do a T25 challenge pack. So I tell you guys that just to encourage you to keep doing what you're doing. Keep being um, a product of the product. Keep sharing what you're doing. and keep keep, you know, talking about your journey. Um, one last thing I'll give you a tip on, which is something that I have really tried to incorporate in the last couple of weeks is getting people on the phone because I was kind of doing everything through Facebook message or text. And I found that if you get them on the phone, you know, after they get interest, it's huge because you can talk them through the whole thing and they're totally excited and sold. Hi, babe. You don't have headphones? She's going to go in her headphones. <laughs> <laughs> We're completely separated by the whole country today. So anyways, um, that's just kind of my, my two cents today is just keeping a product of the product, keeping out there. It will build its own momentum. But then also at some point, if you can get them on the phone for five or ten minutes, you can talk them through all their objections. You can ask them some questions. And you can really talk to them a little bit about Shakeology. Um, it, it makes all the difference and it gets them from interested to committed. I know that um, Erica, even though she's, she's not on here 
tonight, she messaged me this morning and was just saying the same thing because she's tried to be more frequent with her posts about Shakeology. Mm -hmm. And now, now she's posting with her Shakeology cup and yeah. her cousin, um, her cousin uh, purchased a Pio challenge pack today because she saw Erica posting about Shakeology and, and that. So when Erica uh, messaged me this morning and told me, she said, well, it's, it pays off because she's really um, embraced that and posts more and more about her workouts and Shakeology. And so that was, um, I know, a big win for her, too. She was excited about that. That's awesome. She's on fire. Erica, you're on fire when you watch this, because you probably will. Because you're the <laughs> my, my son is apparently getting out of bed. <laughs> when you're supposed to be in bed. Well, my daughter just came in here to ask me for a piece of pie. So I, I feel, I understand. Five seconds, and then all of your toys are coming out and going back to the store. Five. <laughs> Your new pillow is on your bed. What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna freak out in a second. <laughs> well, good oh thing you're God. recording this call. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> God. This is the real life of a beach body coach. Seriously. <laughs> Hi, babe. Hey, Lee. Hey, Meg. <laughs> Dang it. So I was just telling everybody, babe, that this week I've been working to get people on the phone instead of just trying to close, close them through, through texts and messages mm -hmm. and really effective and helping talk people through kind of what it is. Mm -hmm. So in fact, I have one, this lady tonight who's been messaging me all afternoon because she saw my, how to make Shakeology video. Oh, that's good. Because here's what happened is I got two new people that bought challenge packs and I tagged them in that post from how long ago? Was that a month ago? I mm -hmm. tagged the post because I wanted to make sure they made it right when they, got their vid when they got their shipments. And so it brought it back up to everybody's feed. Which yeah. Is so this person saw it and started asking me about it. And she's at the point where normally I would just give her a 50-50 shot. But now I said, okay, let's, great. let's schedule a call for tomorrow to finalize all the details. So that I can really kind of make sure she has all the information. Yeah. Because she collects the whey protein she needs to add to her shake, and I'm like, okay, we need to talk. So that was my big encouragement: was just get them on the phone and talk through that last bit. And also, voice to voice, we know is is going to be the most effective if you can't get face to face with somebody because they can hear you and trust you better. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> God. We're in a strange moment right now. There's no sirens going by. Oh, wait, wait. I can hear some. I don't know if you guys can hear them. There's new sirens going by. Right here in the heart of New York City. I don't know why, though, when I post on Facebook, it says Weehawk in New Jersey. That's kind of a bummer. Oh, that's lame. <laughs> Where is everybody else at? Where's Michelle and um, Erica? Michelle's probably falling asleep on her couch. She does that sometimes. Michelle, you should giggle at this when you watch it later. It is 1030 at night or 1045. We did have our date date today or date day or date night. So maybe, yeah. maybe they just extended it until the late evening. <laughs> hey, let's keep it G-rated. This is going on YouTube. God. So last week we talked about asking for referrals. Any, uh, any success stories or any, did you guys do any of that? No, sorry. I, I got a referral that I didn't ask for. Oh, that's because good. Yeah. Muriel, um, is referring me, her friend that she's been staying with in New Jersey before, um, the work trip. And she messaged me today that she was telling her about Shakeology and that that um, that her friend is interested and has done beach body stuff before, but doesn't have a coach. So cool, cool. Yeah, that is nice. See, they want to refer you, and you haven't even asked. Imagine how much they will when you do it. I know. Well, yeah. she referred to Grace too. Yeah, and Grace is awesome, right? Mm-hmm. 
I mean, mm-hmm. Grace looks so good. You got to mm-hmm. leverage her. I know. So, she doesn't even need it. <laughs> <laughs> she's already like as fit as can be. <laughs> but now she's more bouncy. She's got more energy. Yes, that and she did realize that she will save more money using Shakeology than making her green drinks. So that was the win for her was that um, price-wise she was going to save money and she could get different things out of what was included in the Shakeology that she wasn't getting in her green drink. So, oh, that's yeah. good. That's cool. That yeah. she got it quickly. That's the, yeah. that's, the, that's the biggest hurdle, you know. Yeah, and she's sharing it with her boyfriend. So that's cool. a win too. So. Yeah. Well, you guys, I know the two of you both read that blog um, that I poached from, from Beachbody's website on five mm-hmm. myths about Shakeology debunked or whatever. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. But for those of you guys watching this playback that have not read that blog, it is the most succinct description of the benefits of Shakeology and overcomes every objection you could possibly get about Shakeology in just a couple of paragraphs. So I highly recommend that you guys like, memorize that. Just think of it as a dialogue because it's so powerful. In fact, mm-hmm. yesterday morning we went and got, now that this is probably something that uh, two beach body coaches aren't supposed to own up to, but we went and got Jake a chorizo burrito at oh, Fresh Mexican, I right? I love it. <laughs> Cause you like, us hey, I, get, hey. I get hungry now and then, but Jonathan and I have gone from eating a whole one to sharing one. So that's okay. a win. There yeah, that's a big win. So his, you know, this chorizo burrito, I don't have to talk to a bunch of beach body coaches about the nutritional value of that, but it's $7. Yeah. It was $7. There's egg whites in it with the egg yolks. There are eggs in it. Yes, there are eggs in it. That's the best part of it. So yeah. $7 for a chorizo burrito. And that's the thing is people talk about Shakeology being expensive. Well, I mean, you don't even get anything for you, for yourself except fatter with the with the burrito from the ta- taco stand. But you're going to pay. Gonna, you could buy two Shakeologies for that. Mm-hmm. So that's just something to keep in mind. And it's funny because I was having a conversation about Shakeology um, actually with Carolyn Tyler today, and I gave that oh. example. You know, is she with, is she there? Yeah, they're here. They're doing a little romantic New York thing. Oh. So yeah, and I and I use that example. Breakfast burrito seven dollars, and this is three fifty. You know, like, oh yeah, that makes. I'm sense. gonna put that on my Facebook. <laughs> yeah. Well, and and you're gonna spend more than five dollars to get a, a plain bagel with cream cheese and a coffee at Einstein. I'm just gonna make a list of all the crap that people eat for breakfast, and then I'm gonna break down like four or five popular things, and then. Absolutely. Yeah. Easy to do. It would be easy to do. Um, even if you went and yeah, do like your egg McMuffin meal. I was thinking the same thing. Do a beautiful job of it, and we'll all we'll repost it. I am. I'm writing it down right now. It's my action step. Be perfect. You could do like a little photo of one in the corners of the bad stuff, and then put a little shake right in the middle. Mhm. Maybe I'll have marketing whip that up for me tomorrow. Have you guys, have you seen Canva, C-A-N-V-A dot com? Mm-hmm. What was it again? Canva, C-A-N-V-A dot com. Okay. No, what so is it? Canva dot com is a free kind of graphic design site, but they specifically let you build images for Facebook. Okay. So you can actually, gra- one of the templates is Facebook and it's already perfectly sized. And so everything you design okay. on that. You can put fonts on it and they have some designs you can borrow, but you can easily grab images from the web and make, you can whip up something cool in a second. And those are, it's, it's sites like that that you see other beach body coaches making the fancy. Um, That's how, where Lindsay um, gets all her fancy schmancy bombshell stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. And, but you know, also keep in mind, we all want to be Lindsay Matt way, but she's, She's a double 15 star diamond. She's got two business centers plus 15. She has a full-time person on her staff that does those pretty pictures for her. Yeah. So um, do the best you can with the time you have and the resources available between taking care of your kids and full-time jobs and all that. It doesn't have to be awesome to start. You're going to, it's, we're going to, it's going to just be great. People trust you already and just share the best you can. And then as we go, um, we'll get more polished on those. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. So 
Um, the other thing, like Lisa and I were just saving, there's so many inspirational photos and tiles out there already. We were just online the other day, just saving tons of them to our computer. Um, because we were inspired by Erica and the, and the posts she's been putting in her group, which have been really cool, you know? Mm. Uh, yeah, she's doing great. Now, again, I want to remind you guys one thing, and I'm, and I'm not going to keep talking because we're almost done with our time, but um, you don't have to, you know, to start. Just, you could just use the guide that Beachbody provides. And for my groups, for the most part, 95% of the posts are just straight from the guide. And I know even Jonathan was surprised, right? When he found out that it was, <laughs> he thought I was so good. But it just, you know, Lisa, he was like, wait, are you telling me Eric doesn't come up with these posts every day? <laughs> and I was like, no, babe. He like copies and posts them out of the guide. He's like, I've been thinking he just comes up with this stuff. <laughs> he could, he could, he, he definitely is capable of doing that, but I know. Well, my first group, I didn't know there were guides. And so I came yeah. up with, you know, but I felt, a, I felt a lot of pressure to come up with something every day. So mm -hmm. my thought is, you know, you, you start with the guide and then as you go, you customize certain ones. Like I added, you know, at a certain point, I recommend people go out and buy, buy um, dumbbells mm -hmm. because I think that those little stretchy bands are really annoying. So mm -hmm. um, I say, hey, go get some dumbbells at this point before you get into beta. And, and people are usually excited that, that I did that because they, they do the bands one time and they're like, yeah, he's right. I need the dumbbells. Um, and because T25 is, you know, so active, they don't need heavy dumbbells, so they're not expensive. Um, but, you know, start with the guide and then build on it over time. Um, the other thing that I've done is I have a, I have all the posts in a CSV file and, be, and I bought a Hootsuite Pro account, it's $10 a month. And that lets me auto schedule all of the posts for, you know, for, for T25, for example, it's 70 days. It lets me auto schedule all 70 posts at one time and I can just upload my sheet. Um, and then I can go back in and just add in photos. That's, that me, lets me post all 70 posts in one hour. Uh, so then what happens is if I get busy, which I will, if I forget, which I will, the post are automatically happens every morning. And then when somebody, you know, tags it or comments, oh, I got my workout in, then I can interact. So I can miss I can miss leading for the for that day, but then I jump in and interact with people and never miss a beat. So little things like that over time help us get more uh, efficient. And when you guys do a challenge group every month for like three months in a row, all of a sudden you've got three groups going. It's really hard to keep up with them if you mm -hmm. don't have if you don't implement something like that. Mm -hmm. Babe, are you <laughs> are you so glad it's quiet right now? Yeah. It's been a long day. She it was a long day. She took the kids to Legoland today, and I was in New York. I wasn't able All to. All by yourself? Today. Julie came with me. And oh, she geez. was like, at the end of the day, she was like, so much for my day off. <laughs> <laughs> they, were so, they were so tired because we stayed at La Costa last night. Yeah. And um, Cruz, of course, wakes up at 6 o'clock in the morning then wakes up Grace. And so they're up at six o'clock, you know, by the time we get to the park, I mean, they're like, they're already tired, you know? Yeah. So then we start walking around everywhere. Everybody's hungry, tired. Cruz loses a toy. Like it was just one thing after meltdown. another it meltdown big. And I was like, I'm done. But we stayed for a lot longer. What? Did he lose a constructor bot? He, he found it, but, um, but still it was just like the end of the world. Oh, I can. Yeah. Okay. Well, what do you guys, do you guys have anything that you would like to leave on this recording for the team? For those, those who couldn't make it tonight, pearls of wisdom, little, little drops of your incredible acumen. Right there. Go. Sorry. It's okay. No, um, I don't, no, I, I don't really have anything. I'm just proud of Erica. I think she's doing awesome. Yeah, she's uh, doing really great. So, um, I think she's, I mean, obviously just begun, but I'm excited to see, um, how everything works out for her and, and how it grows for her. And mm -hmm. yeah, 
She is doing great. And she's just testament to look for those, look for those people in your, in your data, in your groups that are just really doing great and encourage them and don't be afraid to ask them if they, if they've ever considered being a coach. Yeah. Um, all right, guys. Well, we hit our 30 minutes. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for this company, this opportunity that we're involved in and the amazing people that we're helping every single day. And I'm very very honored to have all of you on this team. Thank mm -hmm. you for what you guys are doing. And I want to remind you that coaches change lives. So don't underestimate the impact you can have in somebody's life today. We'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>